after a bunch of events in the JBL Cup, giving us new events that weren't in the qualifiers, we're finally back to one that was. What better way to go back than a classic in the finals? Hello everyone and welcome to the JBL Cup Season 1, Event 8, The Funnel Endurance. An event as classic as they come, Eights of Heat will go down the funnels and try to stay in the longest. The top 4 from every heat will move on. The, from the first heat, the Knights of Knights, Team Blast, Silver Bullets, Ghost Crabs, Maple Leaves, Lime Axolotls, Gamma Rays and Team Lemonade. All spinning down the course, Silver Bullets first ones down, who will take the early lead? And who will be the teams to stay in the longest? Right now, Knights of Night in first at the top. Everyone still in the red funnels. We have two red ones. Now we are starting to see three teams dropping to the dark blue. Only two teams still left in the red. Some teams already dropping down to the second blue funnel. As now officially everyone is down in the blue. All spinning, trying to stay in as long as they can. We have a lighter blue color of funnels here. We have just one. And he leads to the small orange funnels. And the big orange funnels. Down they come. You can see two big orange funnels down the course. Then we have three small ones that will lead you to the end. White caps at the bottom. Now gamma rays at the bottom. Spinning close to the edge, falling down. Now it's about staying in as long as you can. You want... Doesn't matter how, you just want to make sure you're in the top four for now, so you can move on. No one is still yet off the course. As all the teams coming down the course. But who will move on? Gamma Rays, first one's out. They are done, Team Blah. They are out next, only two more spots, Ghost Crabs are out, and Lime Axolotls are out. We have our four moving on with relative ease, not really that big of a competition. Now they're all spinning on the end for the win, Knights of Night are out, make leaves, Silver Bullets, and the hit winners, Team Lemonade. All four of them will be moving on to the finals. Now that we got the idea of how this works, let's move on to the second heat to see who will be the four to move on as well. 13 colonies, speed star skeletons, white caps, guineas, team light, sky seahorses, team chagos, and Valdivians. All spinning down, Valdivians, desperate to get some points. They won their group back in the qualifiers. This is another event that showed up there. They need the points. Team Light so far starting in the front, far ahead of the rest of the pack. And Team Chagos in last, first ones to the blue. <laughs> but there's still a lot of time left in here. Guinness and Team Light take the early lead. Guinness falling first, Team Light still on. We already have teams falling down to the second blue funnel. White caps down, Team Chagos, Sky Seahorses, 13 colonies, sorry, are down. Guinness falling down, but we don't... Falling... Where did we go? Oh, we got stuck between the two blue funnels! That means, te can Team Light free them? Yes, but can they free themselves? No! Team Light gets stuck between the two blue funnels and will not finish! Team Light are out of this event! Just like that, they lose their chance to go up! Well, we still now need to see who will be the next three out. As now, it's only the bottom three who will lose. Team Chagos flying down the course, but that's not the point of this event. Unfortunately, Whitecaps joining them. They're already back down. 13 Colonies. Second place team. They need points. They want to make... They saw Knights of Night move on. They need to go up. Whitecaps already out. Team Chagos to the final funnel. Who will be out... Oh, a bunch of teams now here. Team Chagos are out and Speedstar Skeletons are also out. <laughs> and that means we have our four teams moving on. Valdivians, Sky Seahorses, 13 Colonies and Guineas will all move on to the finals. A bit of an anticlimactic ending to Team Light getting stuck in the funnels 
This will give him a last place and a new record here for Guinness in the funnels. An amazing run. But who will win it in the finals? The, the eight remaining team ready to roll down for gold. Knights of Night, Silver Bullets, Maple Leaves, Team Lemonade, 13 Colonies, Guineas, Sky Sea Horses, and Valdivians. Valdivians seeing a chance to chip away at that last place. They know they need it, but are already falling to last place. Teams continue to spin the same top three as it were in the first heat, but this time it's the Maple Leaves who take the early lead. Teams continue to spin Silver Bullets first once to the Blue Funnels. Everyone ready to roll around. But who will be the winner in the end? So far, very close between all the teams. No one is falling too far behind. The Valdivians starting to fall behind. Sky Sea Horses and Team Lemonade fighting for the lead. Team Lemonade will have it for now will be falling Valdivians and 13 colonies far behind Team Lemonade taking the lead and are falling down to the next funnel everyone is still one funnel apart at most Team Lemonade holding on to first they need to keep it going they need a medal for the season and they would love it to be a gold all teams down to the orange that same top three as it were for a while now still spinning as we have the first team down to the final, to the small funnels. A lot can change in there. 13 colonies down to last. Gillis are down there. Valdivians are down there. Silver Bullets coming down. We will join. Knights of Night falling down. Sky Seahorses is about to fall down. Yes, they do. That just leaves Team Lemonade at the top. Guineas are out. 13 colonies are out. Silver Bullets are out. Knights of Night are out. Four left. Who will fall next? Valdivians are done. We have the podium. It's the same three from before. But in what order? Who will get the bronze? It's the Maple Leaves. But who, who will get gold between Team Lemonade and the Sky Seahorses? And it will be Team Lemonade. They needed a point and they got them. As well as a new record. Team Lemonade finally waking up. Finally getting what they need getting a gold medal to their name Sky Seahorses with the silver Maple Leafs continuing their good momentum with a bronze that will allow them to jump up in the standings but what does it mean to the overall standing it's a still close between everyone a 10 point lead now to the Knights of Night as we're ready to go to the next event block pushing the final event from the qualifiers we hope you all enjoyed and we hope to see you then but until then don't forget to keep on rolling.